we come together as one nation and one people to support our fellow Americans in their hour of need. Faith is stronger than evil. No attack, no act of violence will ever break our spirit or diminish the faith of the American people. My fellow Americans, we live in challenging times. It seems like too often we hear of another tragedy, another senseless act of violence against the innocent. In these times, I expect it's easy for some to lose heart. But as the good people of Sutherland Springs have taught the nation this week, faith is the antidote to fear and despair. Faith is now and always has been our source of strength and the summit of our national life. And I believe that faith has never been more important to the future of America. When the days are evil, as Governor Abbott just said, faith tells us we overcome evil with good. So this weekend, I hope a lot of Americans do what we're doing here tonight. I hope the places of worship all across America will be filled to overflowing. I hope that Americans of every background and belief will send a chorus of prayers from their hearts into the heart of heaven for these families, for this community, and for this land. To pray for those we lost and those they left behind. To pray for the injured and those who tend to their wounds, even as we speak. To pray for the good congregation of First Baptist Church. That they would soon fill that sanctuary with the sounds of praise and worship again. And to pray for all the good people of Sutherland Springs and of the special state of Texas. And while we're at it, I'd encourage you to pray for America. Because I believe with all my heart, as long as we remember that we are one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all, that God will yet bless America.